Right, Coach, what an incredible game. Yeah, what, a, what an exciting way to finish the first round. Uh, you know, it was uh, a lot of points being scored. I think for the fans, this was really great. And, uh, you know, obviously it came out in our favor, so we're really happy about that. Uh, but obviously, with the way it went during the game, we saw that we have to uh, correct some things and, and keep working. So uh, happy to get the win, but still got to keep working and moving forward. You guys were really dominant early on, but then it seemed to slip away. Um, early in the fourth quarter, what happened there? Yeah, we, we felt like we kind of like uh, allowed them to stay in the game early. I, I saw, you know, and they came off a long trip. You know, they come uh, all the way from Russia, you know, maybe one day ago. You can see early on that they were a little sluggish and slow, and I felt like we were allowing them to stay in the game. I thought we could have pushed ahead a lot more early on, and we didn't. And uh, I thought it was going to come back to haunt us, and sure enough, it did. Uh, but again, you know, like this team has always done, they show a lot of resilience and resolve to keep fighting and fighting, and, and, and that's what kind of kept us in the game. And, uh, you know, they, they just didn't give up until the end. And then you really rallied back and managed to force an overtime, and then the crowd absolutely exploded. How happy are you to play, to be able to play in such an incredible environment? Well, it's, it's, uh, I think it's a blessing. I mean, because it's a first-year project, we didn't know how much interest there would be. We hoped and hoped that a lot of people would come out and support. And uh, we're getting that, and we couldn't ask for anything more from our fans. They've been our sixth man since day one. It's not something that has uh, grown over the last couple of weeks. Sure, it's gotten more and more, a little bit here and there, but the gym has almost been full since day one. So we, we owe a lot of credit to our fans. And you also had a lot of success in the first round. You made the playoff first go round. How do you look back? Well, I think it's, a, it's obviously a great start for the project, a uh, great start for a first-year team. We're really proud about that. Um, but the way our guys been working and how hard our staff works, uh, and, you know, and the team Limburg United has been working, uh, uh, we're not going to cash in at this point. We'd like to keep working and get, and get better and better and see how far we can take this and, and roll the dice a little bit. Of course. Should we uh, expect a repeat performance next Tuesday? Uh, well, it's obviously going to be a, a difficult uh, situation for us. We're down 18 going uh, up against a great team like Antwerp. They're the second best team in our league as of right now and, and deserving. They've probably been the most dominant team in the second round uh, of the first round. And uh, it's not going to be an easy game to come in here and try to win by 19. But like I said before, our, our team has shown a lot of resilience and, and a lot of fight to always keep fighting until the end. So we have 40 minutes to make up 18 points, and I'm pretty sure our guys are going to do the best they can.